child Oops, childhood I did it again that's the one right i gave you my heart i made you believe oh baby baby this is not the direction i thought this interview was going i'm a champion Cinballa. Oh, we're going straight to me. I okay. had well, well, we're going to do things differently. I have interviewed you more times than I've had hot dinners. Oh. Um, and Damien, I think you're a man who likes to have a laugh. So, with that in mind, how would you both feel if we talked about everything but wrestling? Oh. No wrestling questions. Finally. Yeah. Finally. Should we do that? Somebody wants to have an actual conversation here. Yes, and I something do. Something new and refreshing. Yeah, sounds okay. good to me. Firstly, let's do it quite quick fire. Um, what did you eat for breakfast this morning? Eggs, bacon, and a croissant. Good boy. Hard-boiled eggs, Greek yogurt, walnuts, honey, coffee. Uh, who was the last person you WhatsApp messaged? <laughs> Finn Balor this morning. <laughs> who was the last person you WhatsApp messaged? Uh, right after I texted Damien, I texted my wife. How is the wife? Fantastic. Lovely stuff. Um, when was the last time you vomited? I don't remember. And why? I don't remember, but I'm sure it's because of drinking. Okay. <laughs> what about you, Finn? I have a notoriously strong stomach, and uh, I probably haven't vomited in maybe 16, 17 years. Really? And it, yeah, and it was from, like, food poison. Okay. Yeah. I did, when I was 18, I vomited for other reasons. Oh, they're pretty obvious, you know. But, uh, yeah, I, I, I very rarely vomit. Um, shall I tell you a fact about vomit and one of your Judgment Day um, team members? Rhea Ripley has vomited every day I've interviewed her. Is that weird? Yeah, it's very weird. Isn't what? that weird? It's weird that you know that. Yeah. She, she told me. That's weird. Yeah, she needs to see a doctor, dude. Yeah, she does. Um, or she's just allergic to me. Weird. Yeah, or get some probiotics or something. Yeah. Prebiotics, I don't know. Sort her out, sort her out. Anyway, that was kind of wrestling related, so yeah. let's, let's yeah, move past that. Um, where's the best place you've ever traveled to? Uh, most recently, I really enjoyed Perth. I'll be honest, yeah, it was an incredible place. Uh, great country, great people. Uh, food is kind of like Ireland, so it's kind of like the same for yeah. me. Uh, and it kind of feels like Ireland a little bit for me, so I, I really feel at home in, in Australia. What about you? Yeah, because it's fresh in mind, I would agree with him. Um, when I went, it was beautiful, and the people treated us great. For me, I had like, by the beach, I had that tropical feel, like, Puerto, like uh, that feel like Puerto Rico, so... Uh, I adored my time there, so that's, I'm going to go with the same answer. Okay, nice. Uh, by the way, your match in Perth, not to talk about wrestling, but that was phenomenal. My, actually, my favorite match of the card. Yeah, not to talk about wrestling, but uh, Pete Dunn and Tyler Bate are probably the two most underrated performers we have in WWE, and uh, I think people uh, are going to find that out pretty soon. I am so pleased that they're doing okay, so well. Let's stop talking about wrestling. Yes, yes, yes. Get, get rid of that rubbish. Um, weirdest app on your phone? Uh, I don't know. Like, you can take this one first. Oh, uh, God. Um, weird apps. Uh, Duolingo, I guess. <laughs> I was trying to learn Spanish for a while. Okay. <laughs> but uh, that's kind of weird. I got like a gift maker to make gifts. I got a sticker maker to make stickers that I sent to my wife. Um, Such a loser. Yeah, I got, a, I got a, an app to track my steps which I'm just curious about. I got an app to track my sleep, which oh, yeah. is basically two hours a night, and I shouldn't be alive right now. And uh, you got a lot of weird apps. Yeah. Damien, have you thought of anything? I don't really have any, but social media apps are weird to me, so <laughs> that's yeah, all I have. They are weird. Um, WB2K24, do you in, uh, are you enjoying the game, and what matches are you playing? Uh, I downloaded it and I played it once my brother usually plays it more than I do I'm not really a big video game guy um, but I mean it looks amazing like the graphics uh, the, the way we come out in it together I think it's super cool what about you haven't played it come on okay if you were gonna if you were gonna play a big dream match in 2k24 what match would you choose um, me and Damien against Sting and Undertaker Ooh. That is sexy stuff. Sexy stuff. Um, childhood crush. Kelly Kapowski. From Saved by the Bell. Yeah. Give me a high five for that. <laughs> That's the greatest. When I wake up in the morning. Anyway. Uh, childhood crush. Yeah, probably like at that time. Yeah, or a little later than that. Maybe Britney Spears. 
Mm. Yeah, because that was kind of the hot shake out at the yeah. time, yeah. Favorite, favorite Britney Spears video? I couldn't tell you. No. No, couldn't tell you. The one in the red cat suit, surely. Does she sing the, I'm a fool for you? Is that her? I'm not sure. Yeah, it was, it was so badly sung. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not sure. Um, child, Oops, childhood. I did it again. That's the one, right? I gave you my heart. I made you believe. Oh, baby, baby. This is not the direction I thought this interview was going, um, but I'm loving it for that reason. Um, serious question to wrap up. Damien Priest, who is your hero? My hero? <laughs> Finn Balor. <laughs> Come on. We the, know that's not the a serious answer. The, this guy's my hero. I mean, he is the coolest man alive. I do, I do concede that. But is he, is he actually your hero? It's a tie between him and Batman. Batman. <laughs> what about you? Who's your hero? Oh, Genuinely. God. Probably my dad. I knew you were going to say your yeah. dad. What yeah. a ledge. How is he? He's great. Uh, this is his first mania in a while that he hasn't came to. He just spent a month with me uh, in Florida. And uh, I'm going to see him in Belfast in like two weeks. So uh, he's decided not to make the trip for this one because he's figured, son, that ladder match, that's a foregone conclusion. You guys are going to win that, no problem. That's going to be easy. I'll see you soon in Belfast. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty much what he said. Yeah. Is it going to be easy? There's, there's going to be 12 bodies, probably more ladders, huge expectations. Are you nervous? There's a lot more people for us to beat up at the same time. Yeah. And I got the, my partner's the tallest person in the match, so he has shorter steps to climb. So we're pretty sure we're going to win. And presumably when you're climbing the ladder, you'll be counting your steps on that app? Uh, yes, yes. Yeah. And I'll be fondly remembering how badass I was last year when I got hit by a ladder and had 14 staples in my head. Yeah. And then just finished the match. Have you been injured again now? Ah, it's just an old black guy. Anyway, I'm, I'm being wrapped up. But thank you. Thanks so much. Have a great weekend. Yeah, thank you. I enjoyed it.